Hey guys, this is Phil Swindle from Fearless Social Ad Labs, and I forgot to add, actually I kind of intentionally did it, the instructions on how to add an ad account to your business manager. So we're going to go through this very quickly. First, go to business.facebook.com. Now, if you have an ad account that you've already imported, and we'll tell you how to do that in just a little bit, your screen will look like this, or you maybe have already created one. This is the way your screen will look. So we're going to get your screen for Business Manager looking like this for you. The first thing we do is we go to Business Settings. So it's over here on the left-hand side, and we're going to click on Business Settings, and then we're going to go to Add Accounts. That's the third down, Add Accounts. We're going to click on Add Accounts, and it's going to show my account. But if you don't have one, you're going to have a screen that says that you do not have an ad account. So we're going to add one. There's a button down there that says that will say Add New Accounts. And now we're going to click on Add New Ad Account. And we can claim an old account. We can request access to an ad account. So if you're running an agency or you're managing ads for another business, then you can do it that way. Or you can just create a new ad account. So we're going to give that account a name. And then we're going to tell them who we're advertising on behalf of, whether it's my business or another business. And then I can give the Facebook page of the other business or not, that's optional. And then I can give the time zone and the currency and then create ad account. And so while I'm creating this ad account, I need to, if I have other people on my team, I can add them to manage or to, uh, they can either manage it, they can run it as an advertiser or as an analyst and then they can manage each of those roles for this ad account. I'm going to skip this because it's just me right now. I'm going to hire some people in the near future. So when I do, I'll add them to this account. So then I can click OK. <clears throat> and now my test account is set up. I have an ad account number. I need to make note of that somewhere off site, somewhere in my office or on my desktop or something like that so that I have that number until I don't need it anymore. So I need to keep that number. So I have an ad account here, an ad account for the, for the test account, and now you have an ad account set up for your business managers.